Hi, I'm Sasha Segan with PCMag.com and this is What's New Now. Windows 10 will be available starting July 29th as a free upgrade from Windows 7 or Windows 8.1. If you're running one of those versions right now, today you might see a little Windows icon appear in the taskbar at the bottom of your screen. Click on it and that will put you in the queue for the upgrade. Because this is sure to be a huge upgrade, it'll break the internet when it's released, so we're presuming that it'll be rolled out in a staggered way with the first people to sign up receiving it first. Some notifications will go out as soon as Windows 10 is available. Others may go out in the weeks or months following, Microsoft says, so that's a good reason to reserve it now. If you're a Windows Vista or XP user, you'll probably have to buy Windows 10 for money sometime in late July or August, and you'll do a clean install. And yes, that's still a lot of people. Windows XP still has 14.6% market share, according to net market share, which is almost the 16% share of the combined Windows 8 versions. In other Windows 10 news, we've learned more about some older Windows features that won't be appearing in Windows 10. We already knew about Windows Media Center, but Windows 10 is also ditching DVD playback, floppy drives, solitaire and minesweeper, and desktop gadgets. The good news is that all of these things can be restored by separate or third-party downloads, so it's not too much of a problem. For much more on Windows 10, see PCMag.com. I'm Sasha Segan, and that's What's New Now.